hello people and in this video we will look about some important points in latex so let us start for new paragraph uh, generally people use uh, double backslash or backslash for blank line i always recommend to use uh, blank line for a new paragraph so for writing new paragraph i just uh, leave one blank line and then i write my text okay and in a second point there are two integral equations in a first integral equation you can see that uh, dx is separated by a small space as comparison to the second uh, integral equation first one is the correct way to write the integral equation so such type of small space can be added by using of uh, backslash uh, with comma so this one is the first equation and this one is the second so in the first equation i have added here uh, backslash uh, and then uh, comma and uh, second one is the normal equation which uh, generally people write and in a third point i always recommend to use align rather than using equation array and come to the fourth point uh, it is always recommended to use a predefined uh, function rather than writing a function name so here you can see that in a tag file so normally people write log uh, ln logarithmic function, trigonometric function and exponential function but this is not the correct way to write uh, function's name so for writing uh, function just use backslash log, backslash ln, backslash trigonometric function and backslash exponential function if it is not uh, defined in a letter then you can uh, define your own uh, uh, function name as for example here I have uh, defined POSIC in a preamble so just to use declare math operator and in a first curly bracket write your uh, function name with come backslash and in a second curly bracket write your function which uh, you want to print okay now come to the fifth point so for dots symbol you can uh, use uh, it uh, from the keyboard so second one has been used from the keyboard but uh, first one is used with the command uh, l dots backslash l dots which is the correct way to use the uh, uh, dot symbol page ranges you can show by uh, dash symbol uh, from the keyboard but always use uh, double uh, dash symbol as for example in a big file for a pages i have used two uh, double dashes which is the correct way to use and in a seventh point uh, these are all the commands which uh, one should always uh, avoid to use uh, in the document and for cross references one should not uh, write anything manually but uh, use uh, these commands i always recommend to use uh, c uh, capital c ref and c ref range and uh, capital c ref range uh, with the help of uh, clever ref package which I have already uploaded one tutorial in a display map there are three ways so in the first option one can use uh, the combination of uh, uh, double dollars and uh, in a second option one can use uh, in a second option one can write uh, in a square bracket with a backslash uh, which is uh, always recommended and in a third option uh, one can use a begin uh, display match and end display match if you want to use angle bracket then you must uh, not use uh, this package because if you are using this package and also you want to use uh, this symbol angle bracket from the keyboard and if i compile my file so here you can see that uh, angle brackets are not coming so for using angle bracket one must not use this uh, package but you can use this encoding t1 font enc encoding and then compile it yeah now come to the next point so here you, we can manage our uh, delimiter size size of uh, square brackets uh, parenthesis brackets and curly brackets with the help of uh, left and right command and uh, you should also try to use these commands uh, in your uh, document as per the requirement here i have given uh, two examples so you can see here left right and big uh, command and this is the vertical line with big command now come to the 12th point so sometimes we want to print uh, some text uh, in a uppercase mode uh, in our references so here i want to print uh, h also in a uppercase mode here h is not coming in a capital uh, letter so for printing it in a capital letter uh, we should uh, put it inside the curly brackets so just uh, put it in a curly brackets and now compile your file let us check yeah so now you can see that h is coming in capital letter okay in the 13th point i have mentioned uh, inverted commas so sometimes we need uh, 
inverted commas in our document so we can write uh, inverted commas with the help of keyboard or uh, just uh, use one package which is known as CS code in your preamble and then uh, use command en backslash en code and write your text which will print inside uh, double quotation marks and if you want to use a uh, keyboard then you must use uh, these two symbols this one is for uh, open quotation press it two times and this one is for uh, closed quotation again press it two times now order our packages so actually you can put your packages uh, in the preamble at any place but uh, your hyperref package should be uh, last in the list of your packages uh, except some exception which I will show so here I have some packages uh, ideally it should be last in the list of your packages but uh, if you are using clever ref package, algorithm package, bookmark package, glossary package and I make IDX package then these packages should be loaded after hyper ref package yeah okay now come to the 15th point we can add or remove uh, one or two lines from our page uh, as per our requirement with the help of enlarge this page command and uh, use baseline skip command and also here is the number I want to show by one example here I have one line which is coming in a, in a new page I want to print it in the same page here so here I will use enlarge this page by one and then I will compile my file here so you can see that similarly we can uh, reduce uh, our page by one line so just use minus one and then compile so here you can see that yeah now I will discuss about some common errors in LaTeX sometimes we see such type of errors in our log area in this area so so first one is the uh, extra curly brackets or forgotten dollar if your LaTeX is showing such type of error then you should check uh, the combination of uh, curly brackets and also check the combination of dollar emergency stop so such type of error may come because you have not used uh, any document or uh, you have uh, used wrong spelling of document and in third error uh, I can't write on file that means you have not closed your uh, acrobat uh, pdf file so first close your open pdf file especially if you are using acrobat and then compile your file and in fourth paragraph ended before some command name watch complete if it is showing in your log area here then that means you are using uh, undefined command name or wrong command name or you have missed uh, closed uh, curly brackets sometimes latex reports such type of error too many and uh, closed curly bracket so that means you have missed uh, curly open curly bracket somewhere in your document so just check your file in the sixth undefined control sequence that means uh, so you have used some wrong command name or undefined command name so just make sure that you are using a defined command name missing dollar inserted if such type of error is reported by latex that means you are using a single uh, dollar rather than using combined dollar so just check your uh, pdf uh, sorry tech file and in it if latex is reporting this error means file name dot testify not found that means you are using a package which is not installed in your machine so first uh, you must download uh, this package from the internet and then put it in the same folder and then compile your file or other reason could be possible that you are using wrong package name in your uh, preamble so just check your uh, tech file and in ninth option class for package so sometimes our packages clash with some other packages so in that case you should uh, uh, change the order of your packages or just remove the option missing begin document so such type of uh, error latex reports sometimes so in that case make sure that you have not used any printable text uh, in your preamble and sometimes we see such type of error file ended while scanning use of pen that means uh, you have not closed something properly maybe you have forgot to close your uh, curly bracket actually i forgot to discuss 16th point here auxiliary files create problem uh, in the compilation sometimes so you must uh, clean your auxiliary files time to time so you can uh, clean these files just go to tools and uh, go to clean auxiliary files and then press it ok and then compile your file so that's it thank you for watching